What do you do when you check a trail cam? Find a rat tr uh, rat coon in your tree stand. Please come down. That's my stand. So we're out here trying to catch fish with the fly rods. It's Father's Day. So I got one of the flies on I made, but very happy he's got an identical set that I've tied every fly. So I'm hoping we, got a, we get some fish today because he's already got a strike, so I'm still on short. So let's get out there and get to fly fishing. Rainy. So we're in the water now. See how this works. Uh oh, why is it doing that? Not again. A little bit of wind. Packs don't work the best for fly fishing. Why does it feel like it's going to come apart? It come apart. So this is the fly, I'm going to teach you on how I made it. So I first started out with a size 6 model U302 streamer hook. It's down, it's a 4X large. Then I used a Ultra 70 thread that's black. I started out with making a little um, little wrap around the head where your uh, the line ties in, making a nice even thread base, building it up a few layers so then I can have a nice spot that the dubbing will attach to. Uh, snip your tag in so then you can keep it from catching on everything. If I can grab a hold of it, come on out. Here we go. Trash can's on the wrong side. Why? But, um, I don't know what kind of dubbing it is, but it's green. Only took a little bit out of it. Just enough to say I have some. And all you need is about that much. So all you do, you take it in one hand, take your thread, wrap around it gently. So you lean back, pull out some that's loose, and just put it right back on the hook until it stops coming out. And then all you do is fold the extra that you put in front of the hook just put it right back on because now I got some green coloration that is clear in the water 
and then I'll take my white dubbing take a little bit less than I did on the green and you just put the white on top to actually strike the fish's interest in coloration because white and clear water acts as a shadow more or less a um, like a school of fish of minnows swimming so now you want to build up your head to actually make it look a different color than the rest of it making sure you got nothing in the eye of the hook so then when you put your hardener on it's not in the way but just like that I just recreated that fly for you but I, I forgot the one thing whip finish whoopsie camera is way too close I can't even see what I'm doing What am I doing here? Come on. But you add a whip finish. Three or four wraps. I like six personally myself. But just like that. There's the fly. And that's how I caught that fish. So, well, dad caught his first few fish with the fly rod in the kayak so I don't know he enjoyed it but stay tuned to see what fish we all caught Yep. And I'm hooked on a stick. But he didn't have the hook. He had the freaking tail of the thing.
he had the tail on the fly which the hooks right there at the edge Oh, oh, the dubbing. That's all that fly is if you're still using that green and white. It's a pain to tie because you got to keep everything together, but they look so good. I think the dubbing was like 12 bucks for 10. 10 packs. And that's the end of that. Nope. Got it. Keep getting strikes right there, but they're not grabbing it, they're just hitting it. This Paul does not like this knot. I think what it is, part of this, is it's being this eight foot pole. I think I'm yanking it too hard and pulling it away from it. Yep. You gotta let him take it. Come on. I got a fish right here keeps popping right in front of me. I got too much line. bumping it. They're pushing it away. So what I found, I had an older gentleman teach me. So when you got your hand on your handle and you're pulling it back, leave a little bit in your hand. So when you're pulling it, It's like this, Dad. So then when you catch a fish, you can hold on to them. Well, I was doing that, but then it kept... I gotta move in front of you. Dad. What I like about the three set up here, I can swap dual purpose. I'm almost ready to grab my other pole and throw a freaking lure on it and try to catch that. Yeah, see, the problem is they pulled enough out of this. Look how much of the hook you can see. Yep, You're not even the water. I gotta get out there. You see that? It blew up right on it. Got one on. Come on. Let's go. First fish with the fly rod. So I found out what those names are, fall fish. 
told you I'd get him. I had a smolly right here. She blew up right on it. Oh, come on. I pulled it out of her mouth again. Woo! Fish number two. <laughs> oh, feisty one. Oh, that's gotta be a bass fighting that hard. Oh yeah. So far, so good. Got two. Nice one. You can take a picture and send it to me. But I can come up close and get a picture. Are you just letting them play around? Chubs are shiners. Woo! Camera action. Now I gotta get the phone. And now the son of a gun's got all three hooks in them. Damn it. Ripping their tails off them. Yeah, they're not the best. Flies are supposed to fall apart, but not that quick. Granted, you're using straight doubling with a little bit of line or thread. There's got to be some fish around this tree right here. There's a rock strip right there. Self-mode attack. Attack from behind. We got a slight change up. We're back to the spinning rail. Fly rod was just a little too much for a kayak. Maybe an open face, but not for what I'm in. him fight. But I like my rag to hold on to him, is what I'm saying. 
Cannon catches all sorts of pickerel. Now you've got your lure caught on my line. Problem is, I want to fucking get a hold of the lip, but I don't. fish in the boat either so hold up on the lure up here but you gotta hold it so i can see because i gotta open his fucking mouth you gotta stay with me get the other hand on the boat there we go quick before it goes come on phone come on Hurry up. I got a picture. You got my lure, t or my pole, too. Come on, little dude. Hold him out of the water too long. I guess he's got his energy back. <laughs> Son of a. Oh, I'm soaked now. I am too. Stay on, stay on. Come here, come here. Let some line out. Everybody holding by the jaw. Well, it's both are. Okay. I can't because it's cross drawed. Can you get it or you want me to get it? Well, I can get it. It's not very hooked very well. Need these forceps? Yep. Let me see. You guys want to make your paddle. Of the lip. No, you just hook the other one. There you go. Oh, don't get her eyeball. Try not to. Got it? Yep. Get your thumb in there. Get a hold okay. of the jaw. If it starts flopping, you're going to drop it. Beautiful fish. You want to take a picture? Oh, mine's right here. I got one. I'll send it to you. Face is blocked by your arm. Little rock bass. I've only caught one rocky today. Hey, fins down. Cut it out.
Thank you. What? Well, respect wildlife. I am taking it. Now you've done it, buddy. Drop the pliers. Well, I gotta worry about this fish first. It's in its tongue. Hey, 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 hey. What is it, the forceps you dropped? Yeah. They're right in here. Yeah, and they're black and the bottom is 